Well, before we can use the Figelli linear actuators, we need to download a block, a special bit of programming, which uh, goes into our programming system to allow us to recognize the Figelli sensors. Let's click on the NXT sensors. If you're using the Dr. Graham website, we can click on linear actuators and we can go down past the pictures which show what they look like and how you build them into the system and we come to a section called downloading and installing the Fagelia linear actuator block for NXTG and the address we go to is here click there and this is the place where Fagelli uh, talks about the various linear actuators they've got if you're not using the Dr. Graham website, and we hope you are because it's nice and friendly, uh, this is the um, address that you'd go to. Okay. Well, Fujelli does lots of linear actuators, not just for the NXT, and we've got to go down their website a little bit, and here we find NXT. This is the one for the LEGO NXT Mindstorm systems. Click on here says it's available now we know that specifications you can read if you uh, when you have time uh, it includes such things it'll push at 25 newtons and move at 12 millimeters per second unloaded but we're really interested at this stage in the downloads we want the Lego NXT Mindstorms block so we click on that and we get a save as uh, we going to go into delete me which is a folder on my desktop and the f file LX uh, sorry L12 NXT will be downloaded this downloads very quickly it's a small file uh, yours may be a little bit different because I'm using Windows 7 but we can close that and close that down and here's the folder delete me if I double click on that to open it the file L12 NXT zip is there and is available for use. But before we can use it, we've got to unzip it. In my case, I right click on that and I get Extract All. As I said, I'm using Windows 7 and this is the system they use for that. Yours may be different. Extract All and it'll put it into the folder Delete Me L12 NXT. So we extract that and it tells us well we've got all of those sort of files in there well let's see we're not terribly interested in that we just want to use them we don't need the details so we can close that down and we can close this down as well you'll notice it's got the file unzip file there unzip folder I should say which contains those files close that down now next we'll start up Lego Mindstorms I'm starting up Lego Mindstorms NXT2 but the education system will be the same. Click on Go and we go to Tools, Block, Import and Export Wizard. Now we can take a look at this. Nothing here. We've got a browse somewhere so I go to my desktop in my case. I know that Delete Me is on the desktop. I take a look at that and there's the L12 NXT. I click on that and we get the actuator block in here ready to be included in this whole NXT system. So I click on that to select it and then import it in. It's done and we'll now see if it's there. Uh, if your system of menus has the green circle around here, uh, you've got the uh, first set of menus and if we click on this one all the ones that are in the green circle down here were now along there and we get extra menus and one of the menus is this and if we look along the far end we'll find actuator block that's the one we need for, for the jelly actuator we can click on that move that there and we're ready to do something so it's worked we've got the block down there and the next thing we can do is look about using it so that's fine we've done well close things down no we don't want to change anything the block will be saved anyway and we can finish thank you